hello so this is the pot of the flower and before you close the pot i want to show you that um, place a small rocks inside first then you can add now enough a fiber fill and then you can close the um, this pot here I'm using a wire 11 centimeter for the um, large flower and then 10 centimeter for the small one and I'm using it this 100% acrylic yarn and a 3.0 millimeter crochet hook now let's start first with the sepal form a magic ring chain and six single crochet inside the magic ring then pull to close then round to do a increase in each stitch or two single crochet in each stitch and repeat around and you will have a total of 12 single crochet stitches then round three four five you just need to repeat in each round a single crochet in each stitch for 12 stitches Now once done with the round 5, this is what it look like. Then cut the yarn and do a invisible join. Insert in the second stitch. Remove this stitch marker. Then insert in the last stitch. Then the hide the ends. And then now this time you can use any color of your flower any color you want and insert in the front loop only stitch and do a single crochet in the next front loop only including the um, tail this is one, two, three, front loop only, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. And then in the next, you slip stitch in the first stitch. Okay, our first single crochet here. Insert in here and make a slip stitch. Then chain one, two. Do a double crochet into the same stitch. And then make a slip stitch into that 
same stitch then slip stitch in the next stitch then repeat a chain of two double crochet into the same stitch and then repeat a slip stitch into that same stitch then repeat this around And then once done make a chain and cut the yarn Okay, now this is the small flower. It's the same um, steps on the the first tutorial that we make. Just follow this one. Then now for the leaf number one, make a slip knot, chain of eight, a slip stitch, second chain from the hook single crochet in the next stitch half double crochet in the next stitch double crochet half double crochet single crochet and slip stitch then repeat in the other side of this stitch slip stitch a single crochet in the next half double crochet a double crochet half double single and slip stitch then make a slip stitch on this top loop here then slip stitch in the middle Now for the leaf too, just follow this one. And then now let's make the the stem in the middle of the pot. You can form a magic ring. Chain two. Then 12 double crochet inside this magic ring.
and pull the yarn tail slip seed into the first double crochet and chain two then repeat a double crochet in each of the in the following stitches for a total of 12 double crochet then you just need to slip stitch into the first double crochet then chain two and repeat four round three and four Now once they're done with the fourth round, chain of 10. Now this one you can do, you can customize, you can make your own. But I just show you how I made my stem leaf. I do a chain of 10 and then just do a leaf number 1 and then just do alternate into the following it's same steps when we do the um, the leaf but this time this one is with the stem okay just do a slip stitch in the mid middle of the leaf and then going down onto the um, chain here and then you can do a slip stitch of three 